Hey guys, so today I am reviewing one of my favorite female superheroes, and that is Batgirl. She is from the DC Superhero Girls line, and I just love her so much. She is perfect, and this is exactly how Batgirl would look like as a teenager, and I love her so much. So let me just start off with the packaging. So you can see Batgirl in her beautiful artwork. She's running with a Batarang right there. So cool. I love her little hood. Her ears on her actual doll, the hood. Don't, the ears don't stand up. That's what I'm trying to say. I can't even speak. This doll leaves me speechless. So you can see the school, and that's very cool. As you can tell, I have like one of them right there because I just reviewed her. And on the side, you can see Batgirl with her gorgeous green eyes. And this artwork is just blowing me away. It's so beautiful. And you can see the bat signal, or the bat sign right there. Bat logo. It kind of like crushed the box, but yeah. In order to get these open, it kind of takes a while and it's kind of very tedious. But right here is the synopsis of Superhero High. And right here you can see like, she's her hometown is Gotham City. And you can read the rest. Best Super Friends, Supergirl, and Wonder Woman. And her favorite class is Forensics. That's very cool. You can see all the other crazy girls. Well, she's the only crazy one. She's insane. And make sure to follow DT Superhero Girls on Instagram and Facebook. So, here is her superhero high school ID. And you can see her on her phone. It's very cool. She's very techy and smart. I love her. And her real name, of course, is Barbara Gordon. There, read that, her superpowers, and here you can read a bit more. There. Now, on to the gorgeous, gorgeous doll. I love everything about her. Do I have any complaints? Of course not. Is there anything I would change? Of course not. People are might complain because of the color. She doesn't ever really have purple. She has had it before, but they usually see her like in black and yellow. But I love how they added the purple with this one. So, I don't even know where to start. Oh my gosh. Um, she has this top, which is a, has a hoodie. And it is a purple color. And you can see the little ears, and it's so cute. She's like, so ready to go out on the town. And you can see her gorgeous red hair as it goes through the back. And she has this backpack. Get it? Backpack. Ha <laughs> ha. I make myself laugh. And it is so cool. Hopefully she can fly with this. I don't know how she's going to keep up with Wonder Woman and Supergirl. But yeah, she might not be able to fly. She, must, she might just have her supplies right here. So that's very cool. I love her bat pack. And you can see her gorgeous red hair. It's more, it's redder on the camera, but it's actually like ginger in person. Then for her gorgeous face, she has green eyes and she has this black mask. She doesn't have any eyeshadow, but she does have pink lipstick. She has bangs on the front right here, and that's very cool. And I love that her hood at the end, there's like yellow trimming, and that's so cool. So then for her, this part of her top, she has sleeves that don't go all the way because she does have these like cuffs that do have the little like spikes that you see Batgirl usually have. And... They're so cool, and I love that. It's so techy, like, her top is so, like, program, computer, techy, and you can see, like, the gold bat signal right there, and it's so nice. She has a utility, a utility belt, of course, and it is so cool, and hopefully they release a new Batgirl with more, like, gadgets and stuff, because that would be very nice to see. So this... Um, hand is in a cuff, like a fist, and this hand is like more loose, so, and they're black, so that's very nice, so she's wearing gloves, and she has black pants, or leggings, pretty sure they were to be pants, yeah, black pants, and they have yellow trimming, so that's very cool. She has these yellow shoes, which are very nice, mine came a little bit chipped, but if you have like some paint, you can probably just paint over it. She has yellow shoes, which are very nice, and they look perfect for fighting. 
I love them so much. And they're gorgeous. I love everything about this Batgirl. So, if you want to know a bit more about Batgirl, I guess I should tell you. Her name is Barbara Gordon. And she kind of became Batgirl by accident. And um, so, in one of the comics, she herself um, disguised herself as Batgirl to go to this party. And she ended up sticking as her. And it is so cool. And eventually... Later on in her story, she becomes Oracle, and the reason she became Oracle was because Joker shot her, and it hurt her spine, and that's one of, like, the saddest things about Batgirl, but it makes her so powerful in, like, a non-powerful way. Like, she becomes smarter, and she helps Batman out, and she is so cool. One thing I do hope that they add in DC Superhero Girls is boy dolls, and... I have to see a Nightwing. Like, they have to make a Nightwing, and I need one for my Batgirl. If not, I'm going to make myself a custom Nightwing out of an Alistair or a different character. Because this girl needs her Nightwing. So, Nightwing is, you know, um, Dick Grayson. I'm pretty sure it's Dick Grayson. And, yeah, they are like my OTP out of superheroes. Like, I love them so much. They're like super couple. So, I love her. I can talk about her for... Ever. and I have one more review until I get um, Bumblebee but I have Supergirl and I'm probably going to save up my money for the Barbie collector Superman from the Batman v Superman because I really really want him and I want to display them with these girls because they're gonna, he's going to look very cool next to them so that was pretty much it for Batgirl she's awesome I highly recommend her and if especially if you're like me and loves Batgirl um, yeah, tell me what you like about her in the comments down below, and I'll see you all very, very soon. Bye!